Today I'm going to show you guys how to make rice salads. Traditionally we think of rice as a warm dish, but it works great as a salad and can be used in many different ways. Uh, we'll use our long grain white rice to make an artichoke and rice curry salad. And then I'm going to use our jasmine rice that is very aromatic to create a mild coconut and fruit salad. So we're going to start by cooking the rice for each dish. First, we'll go with the artichoke rice, and what I'm going to do is a basic long grain white rice, but instead of just using water, I'm going to add a little bit of seasoning. So, our liquid is going to be a chicken broth, two cups, because I'm using one cup of long grain white rice. Instead of just using the Swanson chicken broth, I needed more potent flavor, so I'm, I dissolved uh, better than bouillon into warm water. For my seasoning, I'm adding in turmeric, garlic powder, onion powder, salt, thyme, and Italian herbs. Then I will give that a stir. And put that on high. We'll wait for that to come to a boil. For the Jasmine rice, we're doing that coconut salad. So I'm doing a mixture of coconut milk and water for my liquid. Those clumps will dissolve as the coconut warms up. There's the water. Then I'm going to do just butter and vanilla to add a little bit of those sweet flavors and just a little bit of sugar. first salad we're going to put together is the artichoke and rice salad and I'm going to go ahead and warn y'all now it's really good so it's really addictive. It's got a lot of flavor and complexity in its flavor so let's go ahead and put it together and when you try it out you'll know what I'm talking about. I've gone ahead and measured all my ingredients so putting this together it will be a snap. I have the seasoned rice that we cooked earlier quartered and marinated artichoke hearts and I saved the marinade. I drained the artichoke hearts and saved the marinade because we're going to use it. Chopped green onion, chopped bell pepper, sliced green olives, half a cup of mayonnaise, and then the seasoning is curry powder and black pepper. And you will also taste it to see if it needs salt as well. To begin, put the half cup mayonnaise into the liquid that you drained from the artichoke hearts and whisk it together. Once that comes together, we're going to add in the rest of the ingredients. So we have chopped bell pepper, the sliced green olives with pimentos, chopped green onion, and then the seasoning of black pepper and curry powder. And then we stir that together. It's really fragrant and the curry powder really makes this dish stand out. Now we need to add in the artichoke hearts and incorporate them into the dressing and then we will pour this over the rice. Now that we have the dressing put together, we're going to pour that over the cooked rice and stir it together. You want to make sure that the ingredients are evenly distributed throughout the salad. So gently stir that dressing and all the ingredients together. But don't do it hard because you don't want to make a mushy mess out of it. And that's all it takes to make the salad. It's super simple and it's a great recipe to have on hand. All we need to do now is cover it and put it in the refrigerator for the flavors to come together for an hour or two. It's even better the next day. So if you have to have something for a party, you can go ahead and make it the day ahead and it'll be ready to go for the party. Now we're gonna put together the coconut rice salad. It has tropical flavors. It's mild and slightly sweet. And I think you'll enjoy it. We have our rice that we cooked in the coconut milk and a little bit of sugar and water. And I'm going to put in the dressing, which is yogurt, vanilla, and honey. I use Greek yogurt and it gives it a slight sweetness, but not overpoweringly sweet. And we'll stir that together. I 
Now that our dressing is incorporated, we're going to add in fruit. So I have mango, two mangoes diced, pineapple, I'll stir that together and then I'll add in toasted coconut flakes. I'm folding in the coconut. With this salad, we could stop there and it would be delicious. Some other options would be to uh, top it with toasted pecans or macadamia nuts. And you could even add other fruits if you wanted a little color. Grapes would be a nice addition. So it's kind of whatever you want to make it. But this is the starting point for a really good uh, fruited rice salad. Now you have two simple side dishes to add to your recipe collection. Both of these are great spring and summer recipes and you can find them and many others on our website.